Dearborn police officer is on paid administrative leave after shooting and killing an unarmed suspect that was reportedly struggling for his weapon. Now, this happened yesterday afternoon in Detroit. Police say the man was wanted for a probation violation out of Redford and also suspected of a larceny earlier in the day in Dearborn. Investigators say there was a struggle again over the cop's weapon, and that's when the officer fired several shots, killing the man. The National Action Network held a press conference today in response to the shooting, and that's where we find 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig. She joins us now live with the latest. Kim, good morning. Good morning, uh, Malcolm, or good afternoon. And Detroit police continue to investigate the shooting, but the family of Kevin Matthews and the National Action Network believe this was anything but justified. We want justice, and we are going to fight this all the way. Amen. All the way. We are going to fight this. We are not letting my brother die in vain. Instead of wrapping presents with my baby, I have to bury my brother. No more men should be shot down by police officers who are unarmed. If you can't police with your hands, don't police. I love my son. He was a good boy. He was a very good boy. Always had a smile on his face. Always would do anything he can for anybody that he could. If he had it, you had it. He never did nobody wrong. But of course, some people, including police, might disagree because just that someone is unarmed does not mean they're not a threat. We'll have more later today on Action News. For now, reporting live in Detroit, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News. Back to you, Malcolm. Yeah, thanks, Kim. We also